Hi everyone, Rick Bray with BT BOCES, and in this video, I'd like to show you how to make grading groups within your Schoology course. Now to do this, you have to have a course that has students enrolled in it, meaning not only administrators, but also some students. So we'll start by going to the course. I'm just gonna select this one. And when you're in your course, you wanna click on members on the left-hand side. That, as you know, will show all the students and administrators that are in your list. Now, to make this a little simpler, we'll just look at members. If you look at the right-hand side of your screen, there's a little uh, hash line box that says organize members into grading groups. And when I hover over it, it says add a grading group. If I click on that, it'll bring up a pop-up window and I can name the group and then select who's in it. So you can name the groups whatever you want, um, color-based, animal-based. The, the people in the group will not see the name of the group. Uh, but simply come up with a name and maybe we'll do this, right? We'll say Windsor and we'll select the people that belong in that group just simply by clicking on their names. Pretty straightforward. Uh, okay, there we go. And then we'll say create a grading group. And now you see on the right hand side, I have Windsor and underneath those people's names, it also has what groups they're in. If I wanna make another group, for example, main and well, whoops. And then I can click the people who are in main and well. <laughs> okay, there we go. So now everyone has been sorted into a group. What's really powerful about this is you can have people in multiple groups at one time. So we'll just, we'll go back to that idea of red team. So we'll say one, two, three, four, five, six. Those are my red team. And then we'll make a new one and call it blue team and we'll say one two three four five six and you can just keep going to your heart's content but if you notice this is both red and windsor blue main and well right they can be in multiple groups at one time to edit a group simply click on the gear select edit or you can click right on the name and just x people out of the group that don't need to be there anymore. But that's how you can create grading groups. Where that's really powerful is when you create materials, you can now individually assign materials based on a group, right? So under advanced, there's the little three dots that say individually assign. I can either type in a student's name and it'll come up, or I can type in a team name and assign it to all of the people in the red team. What's great about it is only the red team will see this material. So it's a great way to digitally differentiate your classroom. So there you go. That's how to make and edit grading groups in Schoology. As always, if you have any questions, please feel free to email either Taylor or myself. And thank you for watching.